Alright, my husband's leaving. Oh, I can put the trash here. Trash today. The moon. You see, you can see it better this morning. Oh, it's an F UFO. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. It's a UFO. No, it's the damn moon, stupid. I guess my husband. I'm glad you guys ha have the balls to go. Uh, the only thing I got in the mail yesterday was uh, um, some stupid advertisement. So you pretended to have a fucking drill up in my goddamn up on the floor, right? You pretended to do that so that you guys can steal my shit. You know what? You illegally went into that locker. Because the only reason that you are allowed in that locker is if I was an employee and I signed a release form. So if you went in my locker and took anything and recorded anything or copied anything illegally, your ass is done. That any footage that you steal out of my pocketbook, you will go down for. Because that means you stole it out of the locker. Because it's a, oh, it's a low, it's open. It's open. And there was a fucking million people around my locker. And that little, there was an office right next door. So I don't know what you think you guys were going to plan on doing against me. But you have another fucking thing coming to you. The only way, because you already know I studied that. Oh, so what, what class did I study that in? What class did I study that, um, that we had a case where, where, where if you had a locker, would you be able, would the employees be able to search your locker? Search. Search and seizures. You're wrong. You can't go in there because I not I did not sign a release form for you to go in my fucking pocketbook or in that locker whatsoever. Miss Barking Dog. And that fucking black guy. Are you visiting? A uh, fucking duh. You're a fucking security guard. You know visiting times is over. You fuck you jerk off. I don't want to see your goddamn ass today either. There's a couple of you. I told my friend. From college. About a couple of you assholes. I don't want to fucking see it. Those assholes. Them lying assholes that fucking... Decided they were going to pretend to talk to me. I recognized her. I gave her that fucking look. Like she, like, like, like death going to roll over her. And I let them know I know who they were. Oh, no, that's their famous last words. Oh, no relations. Bullshit. I know who the fuck you are. And that was a shot. Who is a fucking attorney fucking general? Or uh, one of them stupid shahs. I, st I studied you, asshole. I put you all over the fucking internet, shah. So don't fucking lie to me. Benadryl. Fuck you and your Benadryl. Yeah, Tory asshole bitch DePetro stole my son's Benadryl. So go right ahead, you and your pussy ass fucking lines. Let me hear some more of your fucking scummy ass lines today. I'm going to have a smart ass fucking comment right back to you.
Oh, I recognize it. Uh, the Tuckers got those teeth that look like that. Uh, William Tucker, the girl that was sitting in that supposedly a tech, and she doesn't usually work in that department. But these people all of a sudden decided they were going to work where my son was at that day, last night. So you know what? You bitches can fucking rot in hell. You cancel my fucking debit card? Oh, you're supposed to cancel my sons, not mine, you lying fucking dubbing bitches. This is what we got. This is what I got in for mail yesterday. Plymouth Rock. Yeah, you're gonna be a Plymouth Rock. Rock to your friggin' head. Rock to your goddamn window, fucking degrading asshole. I'm not gonna stop till she gets committed. No, your fucking history. I'm sorry, Nathan. Cry. You're gonna do a whole lot of it. Cause you guys are fucking evil. Oh, we tried to help her. Oh, leave him in there. He needs help. Bitch, you need fucking help. You have no fucking clue. Asshole. Them fucking places make you worse. They just want to fucking drug you up. Asshole. You need family support and love is what gets you through life. You don't have that, you struggle. And then you become a total fucking bitch. What, 25 some years later? A hard headed bitch after being ran on, stepped on, degraded, and put down all your fucking life. If you had the love and the support of family and loved ones and friends, You don't go through struggles in your life. You don't become a hard-headed bitch. Evil. Self-fucking-loathing assholes. Oh, well, a Christian shouldn't talk like that. He's, I've got a stony heart. And God will relieve that stony heart. And you will... Don't fuck with me. I know how protocol goes. Oh, it's not in the order. Yeah, bullshit. The doctor talked to the nurse. The nurse is supposed to set up the fucking discharge papers. And they better be done. The bitch comes in at 7 o'clock in the morning. They better be fucking done by 9. Because otherwise, she's not going to like me. I know the protocol. And don't fucking... Fill his up and say, sign this, sign this. Bullshit. You don't scare my son and get away with it, you asshole faggots. Praise be to God. Hope is in front of me and my children. Peace be with us. Truth will be told. And you will get your asses beat. And your legs taken out. Amen. Praise be to God. Hope is in front of me.